Sup boys and girls, Tweety here. We're on my single player Let's Play world. And it's time to update. Time to update my sign. As of right now, I have 38. So, 10, 20, 30, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. There we go. If you want me to put a name on there, go ahead and leave it in the comments. Otherwise, that's what I'm going to do, because, yeah, I can't can't see everybody's name that's uh, subscribed. Um, I've done a few updates to this, as you probably heard as the piston in the back. Uh huh. And that's doing the, uh, that's being the mono stable circuit, creating a pulse. And I just have a clock over here. Uh, let me turn it down for a minute. Um, how I had it before is basically it would create a clock out of itself and it would come back down here and re trigger this. But um, it f it failed a lot. Basically, it would stop working. So yeah, I, I did this. Pretty simple, just a uh, what five tick, no six tick clock, because of that, right? Four, five, six. I think that's right. Uh, it's either five or six tick, and uh, goes in and. To the monostable circuit creates a, a pulse, and then you see it uh, just goes up and around. Uh, ch -ch -ch. Yeah, I had to play with the uh, with the stuff. You have to have this on three for it to actually have enough signal strength to uh, go to all of them actually make it all the way up otherwise it, it uh, cuts out about here when you have it on two and here when it's at one I think here I'll show you we can show you real quick I've got time so if we put it on one oh yeah it's not even making it We put it on two. No. Yeah, see that's as far as it goes before the before it uh, doesn't have enough signal to send anymore. So yeah, it has to be on three to actually have enough signal to make it all the way. And then I just messed with this. Uh, with this clock to get the timing right too uh, too fast and then it just keeps them on all the time and uh, too slow and it doesn't look like it's coming to here and wrapping around so yeah there's that I don't want to show that over there yet that's where we're going next <laughs> I've been messing around with the new uh, cow farm idea kind of uh, part of my old thing and kind of based on the uh, the uh, chicken farm um, this is Doc M's uh, cow breed or breeding machine or whatever and I could never get it to work right uh, not sure why maybe the because uh, uh, I had my where I would breed them over there and then they would get over to here and they wouldn't be loaded uh, or something I don't know but it they were escaping all the time and everything it might have just been glitches with the uh, older uh, versions I think I did that in 1.3 I think so but 
anyway, with the new changes to things, it's it's gotten better. Works better. Uh huh. So let's go check it out. And oh, it's nighttime. Let's sleep real quick. And then I'll show it to you. Alright. So, what do you think of my yo yo's? <laughs> Uh, I think I got enough cows on there now. I can go ahead and put the water back in. Oh, here, I'll show you what I was, I've been doing to get more cows up there. So, I breed them while they're up here. And eventually they'll get close enough, and there's a little baby. And then what I'll do is I'll... Oh, darn it, missed. Okay, let's get... This baby. Uh, go like this. Just pillar up so that I'm high enough. And there we go. Click on that, and he's on there. And if they were, if there was any blocks any closer, then they would, when they're jumping like that. They would fall and hit and uh, get damaged or die from it. But with how it is right now, it's set up pretty good. It works pretty well. So let me fill in. I think that's right. Yeah, looks good. All right, and I'll show you what this is all about. So, you breed the cows. Click, 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 click. And then they have a baby. And it falls down there. And then that, you've probably seen if you've watched my earlier videos, but there's a water channel it goes all the way down and makes its way into here makes its way all the way over here and they end up in here and uh, then if you come down here oh crud no it's ruined. Did they make it? Okay. I don't think they made it. Okay. Uh, I had to... Jeez, that's annoying. I had to uh, do a triple piston down here for this because I wanted it to uh, pull the blocks down uh, two right in the center. And I got these on the sides here for... Uh, water and let's go ahead and put some blocks back uh, oh there's that one that made it uh, underneath the sand is a piston and behind that piston is some water or behind the sand is some water rather so the uh, piston retracts sand falls and then like the only spot is like right here in the center and this is where the pistons are the sticky pistons here and uh, yeah it lowers this these blocks by two or three rather and then there's a channel underneath that goes all the way all the way back up and around and over and It uh, makes its way up, up here, into this uh, bridge type thing here, and then they come along, they fall down here, fall across, fall down, through some lava, hit the ground, 
and uh, end up in the kitchen. Right in here. End up right here. And so now I kind of want to do something with the hoppers and get the drops back in here somehow get them all the way over to here maybe <laughs> I don't know if it's going to be possible maybe maybe get them to over here or something I could probably do that up in the ceiling there uh, but yeah I don't know Maybe I just collect it and throw them in. This, this, all this stuff was built, you know, before the hoppers, and something's been in here. Yeah, it must have been just a, a, uh, what are those guys? Zombie pigmen. Oh, yes, still working great. So happy that that's working. I had the hardest time with that uh, zipper elevator. Um, so yeah, that's what that's what happens to him. Now I need a uh, pig one. I need to do something with the chickens as well. Oh, hell. Or uh, chicken pops. Okay, so, I don't know, I think I've done, done the yo-yo thing and I found out, I think I need to do, oh, one died on the edge here, you see. So that, that looks like it's going to be ab about as many cows as I can have before they start reaching the edge. And, uh, hitting the edge as they're bouncing around. But uh, uh, if we go down here, I have, if you go this way, this way goes to um, the pig area. It's just on the other side of the cow area. And I don't know if I want to use this. Maybe because the the pigs and cows are different sizes again. And I think it's Hello. <laughs> um What the Oh okay, so then they come down there. And they go down there and they fall. Okay, so this is like below the area. How did he get in here? Where the heck did you come from, dude? Anyway. <laughs> um, I was thinking I can do like uh, half slabs above maybe. No, that probably won't work. Yeah, that's not going to work because the water wouldn't go there. Hmm. I'll just have to uh, tie into that stream over there somehow. But, uh, yeah, so let's go down this way. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. Oh. Oh, wrong button. Yeah, so the pig spot is over here on this side and this one works very similar to the the other one I just have dispensers oh I probably have to fix those so they'll they'll work properly or just replace them with pistons um, but yeah the water comes out here and here and then this lowers allowing allowing them to go in then fall uh, there's a piston right there see and it lowers allowing the uh, Allowing them to go in to the area. 
Nah, I don't need that. And uh, both of these join uh, down the track a little ways. Hey, Daddy. And they sh should be able to make it up. I'm not quite sure. Can't remember if they... I think the pigs make it and everything. But what else have I got going on? I need to do something with my chickens. Um, hmm. uh, this is still working very nicely. What? All right, why no? All right, am I out of bone meal? Yep, I'm out of bone meal. I used a, the dispenser's full <laughs> of bone meal. Oh man, that's a lot of bone meal. Yeah, so I guess we can... F nah, we won't worry about that. Um, maybe we'll do something with this. Hmm. Well, I'll, I'll check the time on the video, and uh, we'll be back. Okay, I am back. Been uh, working on this. Move the um, eh. move the uh, the hoppers up there, and then they go to this dispenser that's facing down. And I have a clock set up over here, and a comparator. So if something goes in there, it's going to dispense. You know, it's going to run the dispenser until the dispenser is empty. I have a uh, daylight sensor, which I wasn't sure was going to work in here, but seems to be working. Um, and what this does is. Uh, this one will have lava in it. Actually, we can put the lava in right now. And should give a really quick pulse of lava, which will only uh, affect the adults, I think. Yeah, real quick, you know. Um, unfortunately I had to put this on the outside here, um, because that's as compact as I think I can get this. If I move it underground, maybe I'll be able to get it more compact, I'm not sure. Anyway, there's a half slab there. Oh, they're like growing up inside the wall. That's not good. Ooh, that's not good at all. No, it's not working. No. You failed. It's a huge fail. It was. Mm. Hey, that worked. <laughs> Come here. Hmm. Hmm. Well, <laughs> that sucks. I guess I need to make this a two by two area.
Is that down yet? No, that's still... Should be turned off now. Hmm. There it goes. Alright, let me go to sleep. Oh, that's so annoying. Uh, chickens. Chickens are annoying. Because they don't do what I want them to do. That's why they're annoying. So... <laughs> That thing turn on? Yes, it did. Oh, and now they're out. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, and look at that. Oh, because I took that block away. Darn it. Maybe it'll start working once there's less in there. Maybe. There was a lot in there. have this thing on a clock. Definitely don't want these things just running around all over the place.
Um, anyway, this this design here, I was hoping that it would work with uh, one by one. Uh, is actually a uh, Daedalus. He has like I don't know if he has like the dispenser at the top. Like the, I don't know how he has his dispenser on top to dispense them. But uh Yeah, he has uh chickens and then there's uh it's a two by two room with four uh dispensers that do the lava. And just seeing if it would work in here, and it kind of works, but the chickens kind of glitch out of this this area, probably because of the half slab there and everything. I'm not sure. Can't really do a three by three room. Um, yeah. Might be able to do a three by three, maybe if I do it right. Nine dispensers, a lot. I don't know. That'd be hard to hard to configure. <sighs> hmm. Anyway, I think that's going to be it for this episode. Um, yeah, that's going to be it. So, uh, like it if you like it, dislike if you didn't like it, let me know what you liked or didn't like about it. And uh, we will see you next time. I think if that's going to be like that, I think that would look good. Or at least okay. Maybe move this back to there. Hmm. Um. Uh, yeah, that could work. <laughs> okay, yeah. So I'll see you next time. Until then, I am out of here. <laughs>